what up YouTube what is going on and welcome back to Dante's Ranch Room and I am your host Dante and we are back with another video so we've seen some of the craziest amounts of censorship in anime over the years a lot of the censorship I do not agree with especially if I was a paying customer to streaming sites such as Crunchyroll or High Dive even though even though I'll admit uh, some of the anime are so pervy that they might as well be hentai. I'm gonna keep this track with y'all. Some of them might as well be hentai. A good example would be uh, Harem in the Labyrinth of Another World. That show was so pervy that some scenes were just basically a bunch of caution signs. <laughs> like, warning, warning. <laughs> that's how bad it was. And that's why I've always advocated for sites to have a censored and uncensored category for the fans who want to watch either or. But we all know that that ain't going to happen because these guys suck balls. Which, <laughs> by the way, FYI, y'all know I am the king of fan service. So y'all know I like all of that uncensored content. You feel me? But that leads us into today's topic. From Crazy for Anime Trivia, they say Ayakati Triangle lowers anime censorship. Bruh, the censorship in this show was so crazy to me that they were censoring nipples. And no, 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 not nipples as in like exposed nipples. No, they were censoring nipples that was underneath clothing. <laughs> That's how bad they were taking it. It was crazy to me. Whose idea that was? I, I've got no friggin' idea, but we're here to talk about this today and make sure you guys follow me on Twitter because you can see the before and after uh, difference between the uh, older version and the newer version because I may not be able to show it to you here on YouTube because the pictures have a bit of um, panty shots in it and we all know the YouTube gods and overlords don't like that kind of stuff. So. Before I continue guys, make sure you guys do me a favor and hit the red subscribe button and notification bell. We talk a lot about controversial topics and censorship in anime, manga, and gaming. And the goal is to reach 2k subs. So make sure you guys drop a like if you enjoyed the video, drop a comment to engage in the conversation, share this video, and make sure you guys follow me on Twitter for all of your fan service needs. With that being said, let's jump right into it. So it says, after being postponed, citing problems caused by the Ronis, okay, YouTube, the Ayakashi Triangle anime will be shown again from the first episode starting July 10th. And for this comeback, Ayakashi Triangle lowers anime censorship, and the official profile announced it as if it were a good thing. Yep, they made a tweet showing that they created several different Shirogane to censor the perverted scenes something the fans are obviously not happy about so let's go it's already been covered here so i can go down here and it says i got the triangle lowers anime censorship of the new forms of censorship we have shirogane carrot donuts strawberry banana and holding a lollipop among several other forms now this is where things get a little explicit uh, so i can't go Further, sorry guys, I really cannot. <laughs> but like I said, make sure you guys go to my Twitter. Link will be in the description box down below, so you can guys go see the before and after um, pictures if you guys want to watch it or not. The article ends up saying, "I find this type of ad so strange. Look, we reduced the censorship and made it funnier, and the anime is still censored. <laughs> so basically, people are like, okay." So, you made the censorship funnier by adding different kind of characters in it, which, as you can see right here, let me see if I can put it over here. So, they added these guys <laughs> as the new icons for the censorship, right? So, it's like, people are like, okay, it's funny, yay, but the goods are still fully or almost fully covered. So, there isn't much difference comparing the before and after which you guys will see if you guys check out my Twitter because like I said, I can't show it to you guys here because YouTube hates that kind of stuff. So anyways, all I got, supposedly less censorship in the anime. Um, is this a step in the right direction? Um, you guys tell me. You guys tell me when you guys check out my uh, Twitter and make sure you guys drop a comment down below in Twitter so we can discuss as well. And that's all I got for this episode. What are you guys' thoughts? 
Drop them down below in the comment section. Make sure you guys subscribe for more anime, manga, gaming, news, updates, and censorship topics. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Later.